welcome to class. Hey everyone, welcome to day six of the 21 day yoga habit with me, Erin Motts. Today is all about balancing poses and we're gonna do balancing poses, but it requires kind of a, a, a little bit of mobility, extra mobility in the hips. So we're gonna warm up with some hip openers first. So go ahead and lie down and get comfortable. And just draw the knees in towards your chest, shifting your weight around a little bit. And keeping the eyes closed, just let the lower back release. And then drop the left foot down, cross the right ankle over the left thigh, and see if you can reach between the legs behind either the left thigh or the left shin. So mainly you wanna feel this in the right hip. If you feel like your knee is killing you, you can just go ahead and back off and let the foot come back down. But it's entirely up to you how, how far you wanna take this. And as we practice today, I want you to think about how balancing isn't necessarily always just about balancing postures where we're standing on one leg. We're gonna do plenty of those, but also balancing within our bodies from left to right, from top to bottom. Getting a sense that there's the, an equilibrium throughout. Gently let go of that left leg. Okay, take the left foot back to the ground, reach for the inside of the right and find half happy baby. So this feels totally off kilter, I know, but we'll even it out. So you're hugging that right knee down towards the mat keeping the heel stacked over the knee. Take one more breath in. Exhale, gently let it fold back in. Take the right foot down. Left ankle over right thigh. You can stay here or you can reach for the right leg behind the thigh or the shin. And as you exhale, just hug the legs in a little closer to you. We'll take a few more breaths here. Just two or three, in through the nose, out through the nose. Again, focusing on that balance. Exhale, let the hands go. Take the right foot down, reach for the inside of the left foot and hug that left knee down towards the mat. So knee under ankle, keep the right hip down on the floor as well. One more breath in, exhale at the left knee bend, full happy baby. Reach for the insides of both feet, bend the knees, and drop the tailbone down. We're not gonna hold here for very long. We just wanna make things equal, even. One more inhale. 
Exhale, let the feet come together, knees come together, and go ahead and rock up to standing. So go roll over the ankles and work your way up so that your feet are about hip width apart and slowly rise. Instead of moving through a traditional um, sun salutation where we chaturanga and all of this, we're gonna stay standing so that we can work balance uh, in a different way. Since we don't normally do this stuff upright, that's what we're gonna try to do here. So something a little different. On an inhale, pick the arms up. Press the hands together, exhale them down to the heart center. Go again, adding on, inhale, pick the arms up. Exhale, bend the knees, find chair. Bring the hands to the thighs. Inhale, bow the chest forward, look up. Exhale, scoop the tailbone under, round. Back to neutral, straighten the legs. Inhale, go ahead and pull the right knee in towards the chest. Right arm, left knee in towards the chest, I'm sorry. Right arm comes out towards the side. Inhale, open to the left. Exhale, back to the center. We're gonna find eagle pose. Try not to touch the mat. Go ahead and cross left leg over right and right arm over left. Sit the hips low. Try to point the knees forward. Slowly unravel the arms, unhook the legs, try not to touch down, bend the left knee, reach for the inside of the foot. Extend the right palm out towards the sky. On an exhale, start to kick the foot into the hand, find dancer pose. Take one more inhale. Exhale, slowly take it down. Reset. I'm gonna use more space here. <laughs> We're gonna do that same thing again. So on an inhale, pick the arms up. Palms come together, exhale, hands to the heart. Inhale again, sweep the arms up. This time, exhale, find chair pose. Inhale, hands to the knees, bow the chest forward, look up. Exhale, tuck the tailbone round. Inhale, back to neutral, stand tall. Right knee pulls in, left arm comes out to the side. Wah! It begins. <laughs> Inhale, open the right knee. Exhale, close it up. Find eagle pose. So right leg crosses over left. Left arm crosses over right. Sit the hips low. Slowly unravel the arms, unhook the legs, try not to touch down, bend the right knee back, reach for the inside of the foot, extend the left arm forward. When you're ready, reach through the left fingertips, kick the right foot into the hand, dancer's pose. Exhale, slowly retrace your steps, step it back down. I think when you think not to touch down, it makes it harder. <laughs> We're gonna add on just a little bit. So same idea, inhale, pick the arms up. Exhale, hands to the heart. Inhale, sweep the arms up. Exhale, chair. Inhale, bow the chest forward. Exhale, scoop and round. Inhale, back to neutral. Go ahead and stand tall. On an inhale, pull the left knee in towards you. You can stay where we were before, or you can reach for the big toe, extend it forward, 
and then open out to the side. Try not to hike the left hip up, keep it level with the right. Exhale, slowly take it back to the center. Bend the knee, cross left over right on the legs, right over left on the arms. Eagle pose, sit the hips low. Unravel the arms, unhook the legs, left knee pulls in momentarily and reach it back. Reach for the inside of that foot, dancer's pose. Don't think about not touching down. <laughs> Take one more breath in. Exhale, slowly retrace your steps and stand back down. One more round, we got it. Inhale, pick the arms up. Exhale, hands to heart. Inhale, arms sweep up. Exhale, chair. Inhale, reach the chest forward. Exhale, round. Inhale, neutral. Stand tall. Right knee pulls in. Option to stay here or reach for the big toe. Kick the foot forward. Maybe open it out to the side. Last breath. Take it forward. Bend the knee. Cross right over left. And left over right with the arms. Settle in. Sit low. Gradually unravel, kick the right foot back, reach for the inside of the foot, extend the left arm forward, find your variation of dancer's pose. Exhale, slowly step down. Give the legs a little shake. <laughs> Inhale, pick the arms up. Exhale, soften the knees and just fold forward. Think kind of like a, a rag doll. So just cross the arms, sway left, sway right, left, right, left, right. And come back to the center. Walk the hands forward, walk the feet back. And I want you to swivel to the right to find side plank. You can stay here. If you wanna challenge your balance just a little bit more, you can bring your left foot to the inner right thigh for tree. Exhale. Left hand down, left foot back. We're gonna swivel to the other side. So left foot comes down, side plank, or tree pose. Ooh, this side feels tougher. Right arm up, breathe. Exhale, right hand down, right foot back. Feet together, knee is wide. Child's pose. Inhale, walk the hands in. Lift the chest. Find a comfortable seat. Doesn't matter how you sit, just however it feels good for now. Let the eyes close. And let your breath slow down. As you go through the rest of your day, 
see what you can approach with a little more lightness, a little bit more of a sense of humor. Remembering that it's always okay to falter, to wobble until you figure it out. And your next breath in, sweep the arms up overhead. Press the hands together and exhale them right down to the heart center. Let the eyes open. Namaste. Just wanted to thank you again for joining me for class and also remind you that the full 21 day series lives inside Bad Yogi Studio, as does over 200 something classes and over 100 hours worth of yoga. Um, when you sign up now, you also get two weeks for free. So definitely take advantage. Head to studio.badyogi.com and I'll see you inside.